Hello everybody, I'm Landa, aka Creative Mommy of Two. And welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new and it's the first time you've watched one of my videos. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. And as you might have guessed by the title of this video, I have a new unboxing for you. This is yet another part of my Black Friday oh, purchases. This is No More Dragon Breath by Randall Spangler. This is a round diamond painting, which you obviously see by the circle on the box and the pink stripe. I'm going to get the plastic off now so that I'm not struggling anymore. Like this, my cat has something to play. <laughs> yes. If you've been here before, you know my cat Luna likes to play with plastic and oh, paper, especially boxes. But yeah, this diamond painting is, as I said, round and it's a 56 by 56 centimeter in diameter. And I forgot something. These two needed to come out still. <laughs> so we have the little sticker. There, <laughs> they didn't want to come off. For on the box, which I will do as usual when I will store them away. So that I see at which part I need to put them. Oh boy, this has it of bags. Jesus. How did they fit it in? But yeah, the regular toolkits, two heart sh shaped pieces of wax, a four placer, a small boat with funnel, a grippy for the pen, and the pen. And a <laughs> ton of bags. Not that I am complaining because I like these bags to get down my projects. So yeah, it's always nice to have them. <laughs> but that will go back in the box. And where do we need? Here do we need to be? See if I can show you the cat today again. Because she's playing with the plastic. Yeah, now she's going to lay cute. A few moments ago she was attacking the paper. Like whatever. <laughs> Come on. Here, new bag. <laughs> So, I'm going to roll it the other way, since this is a hot glue canvas, you can do it, so it lays flat a little bit quicker. So we have the drills, in which we look at in just a little bit. It has the canvas number and the title of the canvas, No More Dragon Breath. So, in case you store your drills separate from the rest, you'll know where to find them, or at least which kit they belong to. A step-by-step -step instruction book, again, for the cat to play with. <laughs> she is laying on top of it directly. Let's see if we can show her again. No? No. She's already like, ooh, busted. Oh, seriously, cat. <laughs> so, if you hear some noise in the background, it's Luna. <laughs> she will probably be playing for a little bit now because now she has something to play with. I am going to show you the 
sticker with the complete inventory sheet or inventory the symbol list so you can decide for yourself if these symbols are confusing or not we have 53 colors and a whole load of oh, leftover stickers because these are stickers and yeah you can use them for different projects or well labeling something else that you need to store away <laughs> no one says that you can only use them to label drills i can obviously maybe you saw it you can put your start and end date in there also if you would like so here we go oh it's so cute oh yes needs to work along because now it curled the other way that's my luck yeah this is a round diamond painting so the image isn't the most clear at this point but as soon as you place the drills it will come right to life so yeah but I think you can still see what the image is because it's still clear enough to see that it's this image <laughs> so yeah I'm going to open up the bag of bags so if you don't like the noise mind your ears and if you do like the noise you can always turn up your volume <laughs> cat when I did that. We're just going to start with these few separate ones. <laughs> She's going completely crazy. <laughs> and here we already have our first AB. 141. Beautiful white Very much used by Diamond God Club, but a really beautiful color. <laughs> and you probably hear me giggling with the cat quite often. So these are just separate. Let's see. We'll start here for now. I'm to hold them that you can at least read them at some point. So trying to not take too long with the drills. But obviously you can skip it if you want. Let's put that one over there. And there will went a string of drills on the floor. Hopefully, yeah, there we go. Just wanted to say hopefully my camera will focus. And there is the next AD. This is a beautiful light pink. And one try to escape. <laughs> it's cut right there in the center maybe it survived maybe it didn't we'll need to see let my camera focus for a bit there we go Oh, 
And another AB. 104. I think like a beachy kind of color. Can't say I have seen this one before. But again, really beautiful and nice and sparkly. And here we have the fourth AB. A beautiful light blue. Number 101. And then I need to grab my drawers off the floor. And let's do the last bit. And the last color. So let's see. The ABs, where do they go? I have a suspicion where the white and the, especially the green will go. But first, the blue is symbol one. So let's see where I can find that. I'm sorry if my face is in the way. There wasn't much, so I don't expect to see a lot. Oh, here in the mirror. There's a bit. Can you see the mirror on top? Yeah, you can. So over here. And it wouldn't surprise me if that would be all. Can't see anything right now, so I expect that will be all. The uh, peachy pink, the 104, number 2. Need to look for that one again. So again, sorry if my head is in view. That's the only thing with the round drills because it has so much different colors. Really hard to find. Okay, I'm going to pause you for a second and try to figure out where they are. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I found them. Or at least I found some. <laughs> the freckles in its face. The... What is it? Horns? Ears? No clue. There are a few. On its knees, its belly a bit. And on the toes. But there are... Just a few of each, so yeah, they were pretty easy to miss. <laughs> then the more purpley, purpley pink, the 126, number three. That was, where did I see it? I saw it everywhere when I was looking. Oh, there. But in this bottle, you see it over in here, a bit over here on the top. Here in the whoop, here in the foam, well foam, the uh, toothpaste. A bit here. A bit over here in the bubbles. A bit over here in the I think glass it is. And I think those are ABs in the background but it's really hard to see in this canvas so yeah there might be more sprinkled around everywhere and then the last one the white this is 
I said the green AB, but there is no green AB in this one. <laughs> I am so used to the dragon paintings having green AB, the 134, that I automatically thought it had that one. But this one only has the white that is also very common in the dragon diamond paintings. But this one has no green. It has blue, pink and purpley. So, yeah. But... Back to what I was saying, the white. <laughs> on top of its ears, on top of its eyebrows, its eyes self a little bit, the nose, the toothbrush and toothpaste, pin on its arms, on top of this bottle here, over here, a little bit in this, I think this is a part of the mirror, the white Outline on top of the glass and a bit here. Oops. Down here in the bubble stars a bit. Over here in the again in the toothpaste. So it will be pretty shiny toothpaste, I think. Also, this bottle also has a B also in the cap of it. Down here, this part of the bubbles in its toenails. And also here on the, I think, oops, sorry, let's have it a little bit higher. So the bubbles over there has some, the like, counter, sink, yeah, I think sink is the word. It has some and bubbles and the toothpaste. So yeah. All in all, I think this will be a really fun kit um, with Diamond Dog Club and Randall Spangler's image. The rendering is most of the times really extremely good. So I expect to get a really, really amazingly beautiful image out of it. So yeah, as with most of the kits I have, I do really want to start this next, but yeah, I have a list of Diamond paintings I want to do next, so we'll see when this one gets done. <laughs> but I hope you liked this video and it made you helped you make a decision on whether or not you want to buy this one or not. And yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, comment down in the comment section below or in my email in case there is something you want me to know. And if you haven't already and you like this video, please consider subscribing to my channel for more mainly diamond painting stuff. And again, I hope you liked it and I hope to see you next time. Bye!